Welcome to the final round of the regular season. It's one of the great rivalries in sport. It's New England versus New York. New England received this one on that far touch line. Yeah, number plays missing for both these sides. New York, they go with Geiger, accurate throw. Tuiloma has it at the back. Geiger joins right now. In there as well as Dylan Foster, the butcher on the right. They peel away. Geiger goes on the short side, flicks it in beautifully. Smashing for the line. Kalola Tuilomo, the bulldozer, just short for New York. Reaching. And Salmi says, not there yet. Tuilomo picks up and batters his way over. That's the first try of the game. And rugby New York start this game on fire. They score within the opening four minutes. And Kalola Tuilomo smashes one in. Take a look at the line out here. Beautiful little set piece right up to that front jumper. All the way back to Geiger. Snags it out of there and peels off here to the left. And right away, within five, there's Tui Lomo with his first carry. Gets in close. And then here's the finish. Tui Lomo, ball at the feet. Sneaks in just to the inside of that post defender for the try. Perfect, sounds good. Windsor, lovely looking strike from Sammy. And he's got the flags up. 7 nothing. New York lead New England. At the back is Terrell Pater, the 22-year-old out of New Zealand, one of the young signings that has been key for New England. Waka off the left boot, just driving New York downfield, happy to defend. So a lot of different permutations here, calculators are out, numbers will be crunched. In round 18 of Major League Rugby Season 5, who are in LA, the defending champions from last year. New York, drive, powerful, drive, Tuilonga comes in, Buckley, and then Andy Ellis is in there too, same as Quinnawati, here they peel away, Kalola Tuilomo just short this time, blue jersey swarm in, diving round, Ellis gets in underneath it, oh the L dog has got new tricks still, the all black legend scores for New York and that's their second. Off of the back of the line out here, nice front take. Bringing the whole screw, uh, whole uh, squad in here. But as you see, it's Tui Loma with ball in hand. Peels off the side, gets it close. And then the nice fake pass and dive over there for Ellis. Again, it's a solid strike and what a start this is from Rugby New York. Both those games where JFK Stadium in Hoboken, the home field for Rugby New York. Johnston flicks it away, a lovely line from Wayne Funderbank. Funderbank has been fantastic all season, finally flicks it up to Pater who's there. Terrell Pater in support for the Free Jacks, who are down by 14. Quick hands to the Dutch giant, Stan van den Hoven. And now stabbed through by Reeves, a perfect little kick, Balakana is on the end of this one. And New England get their first score in style. Paula Balakana, much to the delight of the reserves. Smartly, and then that beautiful kick from Reeves all the way to the outside, and easy money there for Balakana for the first try of the match for the Free Jacks. Waka for the extra two. Successful, 14 points to seven, time for a short hydration break. Four sisters and three brothers, father was a rugby coach, that's great work. Naholo on the outside, was Saki Naholo. Flicks it up superbly, support is there. Nihi Milner Scudder has gone out of bounds. Oh, Jack Reeves, a 22 year old, can say he tackled the Rugby World Cup winner. A massive hit is New York, look for their third try in this game, up 14-7. Caleb Geiger, again at the back, the backs came in last time. This time Tuilomo is there, and here are the backs with Windsor and Ellis. Driving for the line, it's New York. At their very best, they are built for this sort of stuff. And they punch in their third try. They again bring in the whole squad to punch that one through. It looked like it was Geiger again. You see off the top, able to work it back to Geiger. And then in comes Buckley along with Windsor and the big push all the way through and the try there for Geiger. Windsor under a little bit of pressure this time. Has it successfully over yet again. 
He's laser focused, is Sam Windsor, and so are New York, 21 points to seven for New England. Camp, another great take from the young gun. Behind the back, Wayne van der Bank under all sorts of pressure, so his ball goes wide to Dougie Fife. Conga through Andrew Cote. Balakanu's there. Joe Johnston always gets him on the front foot, does the mechanic. Geiger is in the way, so advantage here for Bodine Walker. He goes back inside again, a little bit of space here for Dougie Fife, the Scotsman. Dummy from the Vampire Youngit, but put in a coffin by Geiger. Still to the left comes Waka and Van der Bank for the free jack. Space here for Wayne Van der Bank. He's electric to watch. Van der Bank is skin three. Flicks it over the top on the outside. Terrell Pater is in. And the New England free jacks can play some fantastic rugby. And when they do, it's champagne. Bodine Waka at Veterans Memorial Stadium. The touchline. Oh, that is a sublime strike. Sam Windsor does it for New York, and Bodine Walker does it for New England. 21 points to 14 is the half-time score. The Chowder Cup may have been won by New England, but New York want to make a statement here to close out the regular season. 4-1, New England lead here. Loose ball, Davidowitz fires it across field to Walker, puts a little chip on the left boot. Naholo read it superbly. It's play on. Oh, Walker comes flying in with a hit in his opposite number. Oh, and they're having a bit of extra action there. Yellow card for both fly halves. No, no, no. No, in number 10. Holding Walker and Andy Ellis. Vanessa doesn't want to bring his fly off here because he doesn't want to get him sent off, but both will go to the bin for two. After the one I don't mind. So you think both? Ten minutes for each. Number ten. I go to the side. And there's a nice Anirandek chair. We'll say on the side of the field so you can get a shot of that. See the chip over the top there. And then Waka comes right into Ellis. And Ellis just kind of an arm there, and then they tangle up. Continues on there for a good 30 seconds or though as both teams enter into the skirmish. So it did look like in some... The Free Jacks will host the Eastern Championship. And that is going to happen on June 19th here at Fort Quincy, as it's known. Milner Scudder, line drives us downfield. Man who's born in Manhattan and raised in Australia. Camp tries to put it through the boot. Johnston cleans things up. Davidowitz cuts it. Oh, the big bump from Cam Davidowitz. The bus is here. Poland wide ball. Creative genius needed here. Balakana cuts back against the grain. Balakana hurdles through. Paula Balakana, you're kidding me. What a breakout. He finds Conradi. Poland. Puts the kick himself, Poland over the top. No, it's been oh. snapped by New York. Co is there. Rolls into touch. What a remarkable performance from New York. And for the first time this season, they've defeated their rivals, New England.